expression. Some people are more expressive than others. So some people are prepared to be more visible with the way they speak. They want to be seen, not only heard. So as they're using their hands and their gesturing or they're using their face expressions, the voice is changing because the body and the voice is one thing. So if you don't use your body and you're just using your voice only, you begin to limit the dynamic of the voice, the expression of the voice. But if you're an expressive person and you use your body, um, your face, it changes the sound of your voice. So personalities here uh, are going to make a difference. So you're going to have some of the most extroverted people will communicate a lot more expressively. So therefore, the dynamic in their voice is also expressive. They can go higher, they can go lower, they get louder, they get softer, and yet more introverted people are a little bit more reserved with their voice. They're inside. The voice is held back. They're less expressive. They're deeper thinkers. They're not so much in the body expression or in the heart expression. They're in their thinking. The thinking is more introverted. It's more inside. So that affects the voice and it can get monotone in this case or it can sound robotic or it sounds less expressive right but then you have too much expression on the other hand can be overwhelming for people because usually that has a lot of information too we tend to add too much information so it can be overwhelming or it can be underwhelming so the thing is it's about balance learning and looking at your profile your personality and seeing what's best for me because I have to be congruent you can't just make this up you can't copy somebody. I mean, we can get ideas from people. We can watch and learn. But then you've got to wear it like a garment. You've got to wear it. You've got to wear your voice. Does this feel authentic? Is this real? Is this me? Is this me? And does it match my message? That's very important.